Hey guys, Stelly111 here with another great review. It's a short one here, but uh, it's uh, Elysium. Uh, I went to see last night. So, before I get into reviewing it, I'm just going to set the mood. Um, it's basically set in the year 2154, where uh, the very wealthy live on a man made space station while the rest of the population resides on a ruined Earth. A man takes on a mission that could bring equality to a polar, the polarised world. That man is Matt Damon who plays Max in the film. Uh, the, the space station is Elysium and I've got to admit the CGI for Elysium was amazing. This game, this game, why am I saying game, this movie was in the top 30 most anticipated films uh, for 2013. I believe it was in the top 10 actually. Um, Matt Damon did do quite a good performance but I would have said it was a mediocre film. <coughs> the director Neil Blomkamp, I believe he did the the movie District 9. He 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 made District 9 a very very good film. I loved that film, but Elysium very similar factor of it, but no. I would I would not I would not say it was a good film. It was looked very good, but it was a big downer. <clears throat> Some of the things, I think it might be a bit too slow paced because you're expecting action and it doesn't really happen until the last few sequences. I'm trying not to spoil it for you, but yeah, it's, it's not the, the most intruding a film that wants you to keep. If, if it was on television, you would probably not have watched it all the way through. There's a few, there, there's likes of. Uh, a few characters that you feel that are quite strong in it, uh, the likes of Wagner Mora, Sp who plays Spider in it, a gang lord, if you will. I'm not sure if it is. I liked his character. He was a bit of an asshole at times, but he was also quite nice and mature. And uh, he helps out Max, Matt Damon, quite a bit. It, I saw it didn't get too many good ratings the day it came out, and a couple of days later I went to see it. It looked good, but even on IMBD, the ratings I would said is overrated. It was not a good film at all. Um, I would actually give it 65% on IMBD. It's 7 out of 10, but I'm sorry, but 6 out of 10 for me, maximum. Well, 6.5, but 65% is my rating for it, and I would say it's a mediocre film. If you can pick it up for a fiver, it would, it would enter, it would keep you, if you had nothing to do, it would keep you occupied for an hour or two, well, I think it was an hour and a half it runs for. Uh, something similar to that, but uh, yeah. Hopefully you enjoyed my review. Um, It was an okay film. But not good. I would not have said it was a good at all. It was okay. Okay, mediocre. <laughs> mediocre is its classification. So thanks for watching. Please drop a like and subscribe to my channel. Become a militia member for some more reviews on the way sometime soon. I'm trying to get more reviews now. Because uh, I'm going to be watching lots of films. So thanks for watching. Peace.